video, we are going to review one of the three ways to accession samples into Clarity Limbs. This video will demonstrate how to use the sample management page to upload samples into a project. From the Projects and Samples screen, you can create a new project by clicking the blue New Project button. You will then see that you need to give your project a name, an account, and a client. Once the mandatory fields are entered, you can click Save. You will then see your project appear on the projects list on the left-hand side. If you scroll down, you will find a green button called Add Samples. When you click this a new page will load called Sample Management. I like to think of this page as the Excel template in GUI form. At the top of the screen, you will have the options to add multiple samples by clicking the blue Sample button. Each page will hold four samples, and once you get past that, you will have to toggle through the different pages. This sort of accessioning may be more favorable for smaller projects, so you can see all of the samples on one screen. As you go down the page, you will see the project details. This is all of the information that you have added on the projects and samples screen. Here, you have the option to upload per sample files if you choose to do so. In the Sample Details section, the first few fields are those mandatory fields that we see on the Excel template. All of your samples need a name, We can skip past the LIMS ID because Clarity will automatically assign a unique identifier to each sample. We can also skip past the date submitted as that will automatically be filled in. Your samples need an assigned container and here if you click into the drop down, you will see all of the available configured containers in the system. If we select a 96 well plate, we can copy that across to all of our samples by pressing this arrow on the left-hand side. Your samples also need a container name. The wells will get automatically assigned, but you can overwrite them by typing right into the field. If you happen to put in two of the same wells, you're going to get an error message that will not let you proceed. So each well on the plate needs to be unique. When you scroll down, you will see all of the available configured submitted sample fields in the system. If there is no asterisk next to the field, it is optional. We will give our samples some volumes and a concentration. Once we have filled in all of our metadata, we can scroll up and click the green Submit Samples button. Our samples have now been submitted successfully, and we are going to start doing work on them.